Hi there, this is Miles from Light Harvest Solar. Uh, we just installed uh, this 300 watt, 305 watt panel on this um, big uh, 4x4 van here. And I just wanted to see, show you something. This had a, uh, I don't know, I believe it was a Renergy 100 watt and an 80 watt run into this. And they had, there was a bunch of issues with it, but I want the main thing I want to show you if I can get that on there is that this is putting out 180 watts of theirs is putting out 0.8 amps ours on an MPPT controller an industrial grade panel on the MPPT is putting out four five amps so five amps here 0.8 amps there so that's like five six times the amount of power um, for uh, the amount of wattage that it is they've got it through this rebadged it's just a it's a rebadged Victron jobby that is a ep ever or ep solar um pwm so they've got 180 watts through a pwm on kind of a cloudy day making 0.9 amps and r300 on a on a, a nice mppt is making five amps uh i just wanted to show that i did a pretty the, we've got full river agms that are actually pretty impressive batteries considering i'm not a fan of agms uh we were able to run the run the uh hair dryer for I don't know 10 15 minutes so that was pretty nice uh, anyway the comparison between a low voltage PWM system and a high voltage MPPT system 305 watts versus 180 watts thanks a lot bye